All right, guys. Well, I'm back today with an insanely impressive high value and budget dagger. And this one is incredibly interesting. The fact that it uses premium materials like a D2 steel blade, as well as G10 handles and some insane hardware. Also, the fact that it includes a really nice Kydex sheet with a locking system perfect for like a regular belt setup or a battle belt setup and combine the option to mount this to a plate carrier. You have an impressive fighting knife at an affordable price. So I've been digging into the high value and budget knives on Amazon lately and I've been buying some to feature for you guys to show you what is available right now and I've been really digging through and trying to pick the best options again on Amazon. This one comes in at $27.99 and there's a clickable 5% off coupon dropping the price down to $26.50. And when you consider what you're getting with this knife at the price, it is an insane value, especially for a budget personal defense fixed blade dagger. Again, where this is really going to shine, I feel like is attaching it to a battle belt setup, just an EDC belt setup, or some type of plate carrier. And this dual edge blade is again, perfect for personal defense situations. And it is a really slick design. You can see how thick the blade actually is and how nice the G10 handles are machined and flow with the handle itself. It's actually a full tang knife, so you can see the tang is part of the blade and it goes all the way through the handle. So that is going to be insanely robust. The grind on this is also really nice and it has some serrations on the side in case you needed those to cut rope. This is also a functional knife for a wide variety of other tasks. But again, it's reasonably compact, but definitely long enough to be a formidable opponent. And the Kydex sheath is done really nicely as well. When you're talking about Kydex sheaths, a lot of times if you're getting custom Kydex sheaths made like this, they're going to be $30 or $40. So when you consider you're getting all of this for $26.50, that is a great deal. This one has a push button operation for the belt attachment. You can also see it as a wide variety of ways to shift this around, rotate it left and right to mount it in almost any configuration. So if you want it parallel on your back or if you want it vertical, you can do that and change that around with this sheath. It also has spacers which are removable and adjustable to fit a wide variety of belt sizes. Again, generally when you're getting a Kydex sheath like this, that is a great deal in and of itself when you're talking about the sheath that's included with this knife. You can see the attention to detail and the stonewash finish on this blade. And that D2 steel was a more premium steel over others. It's going to hold its edge a lot better than some other budget steels. And you can see the hardware they used on this is also insanely beefy. That is really cool. And it also has finger grooves cut into the G10 and a lanyard hole at the back, as well as holes through the hardware itself. So the other thing about this, it would make a great survival blade. When you consider this for a bug out bag or like a camp bag, this could be lashed on to the end of a pole or a stick to form a spear. And it gives you a ton of different options because of the holes located throughout the handle. It also has really nice guards right here. And it's incredibly ergonomic with these grooves cut in here if you wanted to use it. Uh, either way, this is a solid knife option. And again, because that blade is so thick and because the handles are so thick, you can kind of wrap your thumb around the bottom to puncture in. This is a really slick knife at an affordable price. Uh, I was reviewing some of these before and they sold out in like a day and a half. So if you're interested in something like this, I would jump on it. They seem to be going pretty quick and the restock time on some of those other knives I reviewed last week is already into June. So something like this is in stock right now, free prime shipping, and it's got a clickable 5% off code on the link. Definitely check it out. If you guys have any other ideas or suggestions for budget knives, definitely let me know. I've been really digging in lately, so if you have any model numbers you want to leave in the comments below, have you ordered some of the other ones I reviewed? Let me know your thoughts on those. I'm really excited about digging through and finding some more. I've got a couple coming this week, and I've also got some EDC items. So again, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, what you want to see on this channel, and definitely subscribe if you haven't done so. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one.